These are all weapons in vehicles. Oh god. Oh oh my god, they're flying on the side of it. Guys, that's that's oh wait, what are you doing? Stop it! Oh god, this is gonna be bad, isn't it? I, I gotta watch this. This is like Sorry, buddy. These are all vehicles from Metal Slug. So we're gonna be checking them out, and then, in a little bit, what we're gonna be doing is having them battle the regular Ravenfield vehicles to see who is superior. That's such a funny looking truck. Okay, it's this is an interesting aimer. They put the scope within the tank barrel. Oh, okay. Oh, the miniguns twirl. Oh, and they move. That's pretty impressive. And this tank jumps. Well, what's my health? What is behind me just shellacking me? Stop it! I love how the dudes are just standing on the wings. Well, that was interesting. It does seem like they're pretty fast. I I'm not sure if they're faster than the regular Ravenfield ones. We'll do that when we actually have them battle each other. All right, so I need to be... Yes! Oh. Okay. I've got- oh, I've only got one guy on my wing. Bummer. Uh, that's friendly airfield. I don't think I'm faster. I might actually be a little bit slower. These are like heavy bombers with little rear gunners. Oh, bombs away? That's a big bomb. I feel like Top Gun right now. Flying into the danger zone right here. I want to see my gunner on the side. <laughs> yes! Get him, buddy! I, just, I think I think I just killed someone with my wing. <laughs> Every time you're in the cockpit, it's like flying to the danger zone is on. And then when you're not, it's like, oh, just a regular day. They're very maneuverable. And them, buddy! <laughs> I can slap them with my wings. That's proving to be the most effective. So this is much more maneuverable than the Ravenfield planes. Oh, parachutists, paratroopers. Think we can hit one? How am I missing? You know what? We can always just, you know, hit them with the wings. <gasps> Ronnie and Steel Raven. The man, the myth, the legend. <laughs> this music is so ridiculous. <laughs> Let's try these rockets out on this very strange looking transport truck. Rocket one is away. Oh my. You see them speed up? That's really interesting. Jump off! Where's my friend? Let's land! Don't break your knees! Oh, he, he broke his knees, most definitely. Ooh. Now there's this bomber. Do I have a gunner? I think so. I think it's safe to take off. Yeah, rear guns are moving. All right, I've got twin machine guns in the front and then just one big bomb. This thing has to be pretty big, right? Pretty powerful. Let's see. Oh, I don't have a bomb sight. All right, let's see this thing go off. 15 kills with one bomb. Okay, that thing lived up. Fighter was trying to chase us. Rear gunner's doing his work. So I think our bomb is definitely more powerful. So I'm at 15 kills right now. I don't know if that was a very good bomb. No, that, that, oh wait, it's right over their heads. Can you imagine being those guys? Oh, never mind. They're dead. So while this is a little bit silly, I think I think they're actually better. Now we're gonna see if one of these bombs, assuming, because I don't really have an aiming reticle on the bomb, if it can destroy a tank with a near exact hit or a near direct hit. Oh, that's gotta be a near direct hit. It was a near hit, not a direct hit. I'm like, let's establish the terminology and I'm gonna totally mess it up. And drop it. Slow mo. Oh, not the best hit. Wasn't able to take out the vehicle. So these bombs are very, very good at anti personnel, but not very good at anti vehicles. Way off. I think you just have to be direct, but they don't have an aiming reticle. Now, the other vehicle is the tank. Whoa, he's fast. No, he jumps. Give me this back. So what we're gonna do is try to bum rush this flag point and take it single-handedly. The enemy hasn't arrived, but we have, I don't, ooh. The miniguns on the side are great. That is really well done. Only one fires when you're looking at the side, but two can fire when you're aiming, well, where they're aiming. And they don't run out. 
There's the enemy. They're not very accurate, though. Okay, something is just destroying me. The fighter with the rocket pods. So now what we need to do is change the vehicles to official vehicles. But you'll notice for helicopters, we don't have them. And what we need to do is battle. So this game will be decided by points. Now I've got to put myself in the best position and I honestly think it's the bomber. There's just something more fun about flying aircraft. So if we're lucky, we should be able to do a bombing run right on all of their infantry, which should be grouped up. Oh God, on the runway. Well, that's five. Bombs away. Can I destroy a plane in one hit? Well, only if I hit it. Ooh, pull up. Oh my goodness. That was incredible. Every time I drop the bomb, it's five kills. Get him, bud. So let's see. They've got three flags. Wait a minute. We just lost our first four soldiers. And they're down to... They've lost 37. Is that because my AI friends are dominating too? Oh, here we go. Bomber plane in our sights. I'm much faster than him. Uh, that was a little bit of friendly fire on the bomb there. Shh. Don't tell my boss. So our bomber can actually be like a fighter bomber and their bomber is just a bomber bomber. There we go. <laughs> Did you see that guy? Calling in air support. Tank sighted. Can I get a direct hit for once? Oh, that was a direct hit and it didn't take it out. So these bombs are uh, high explosive and I guess like you wouldn't consider them anti-vehicle. Oh, direct hit on the cassowary. Still only 15 kills. And I am so much more maneuverable than a bomber plane. Oh, that looks good. That is a direct hit on a prowler. I can't directly hit a tank very often, but I sure can a smaller vehicle. We got a fighter in our sights. I can't tell if he's faster than me or not. All right, he's, he's not letting us get him he's not doing any evasive maneuvers he's definitely faster than us all right i'm more maneuverable than the buzzard is wait what's happening we went all the way outside of the map to get that guy let's rearm primary machine guns guys we are dominating metal slug vehicles seem to be superior checking the map we have an armored vehicle moving in oh i see him He's right to the upper right of my aiming reticle right now. And that's a friendly plane. Oh. Dive bombing mission has been requested. Slow-mo. Yes. Destroyed a prowler and hit the tank. Not enough to kill it. I feel like this transport is just kind of flying intel, like directing troops. Get him, gunner. Can he take him out? He's hitting him. Oh, not enough. Let's loop back. Wow. Okay, we've lost 70. The enemy has lost 147. That's insane. Boom! <laughs> Is it dead? Oh my god, it's not dead. You're kidding me. Okay. All right, so let's try some ground vehicles now. Hey, you took my tank, man. Oh, okay. I love how it can jump just like the one in Metal Slug. <laughs> I'm moving in with the tank column. Enemy troops sighted. Slow-mo. Yeah, look at how poorly accurate these things are. But it doesn't matter when you can fire this frequently. Your fire rate is amazing. Wait a minute. Oh, they've got an enemy machine gun truck. I tried to hit it with my main guns. There we go. I mean, if there's a hundred guys in a line, you're gonna get a lot, but I guess that goes like any machine gun. Look at this. Wait, is that? Oh, I can't even tell my health right now. Ow. Am I hitting it with my main gun? I don't know. Oh, maybe it only fires forward. It only fires forward because the gun, it's its not a rotatable turret. 
Of course. Look at how many tanks we have chilling here. I don't think the AI is very good at using these things. Come on, boys. Uh, we have 188 men. They have 48. I've only killed 26. It's not like I've done an insane amount. I've done a good amount, yes. And I have taken out six vehicles, but look at theirs. They have people that the most vehicles they've taken out is someone took out three. We've taken this flag point. We have five flag points. They have one. Yeah, it's also dumb, but they're dumb on both sides. It's really the vehicles that are the deciding factor here. Now, where is their last flag point? It is the hilltop up here. And in fact, I think we have an APC up there already. Oh God, oh God, don't fall down that cliff. Hey, I gotta remember we can jump. Oh, they captured the quarry back. Probably using transport helicopters. That's one of the vehicles that they have that we do not, is helicopters. Transport and attack variants. But I mean, look at how many tanks we have. This is Operation Desert Storm right here. And this is the last guy. Sorry, Turner. This here is Metal Slug Territory. Uh-oh. Oh, I disabled a Rhino with a grenade launcher. Granted, I got the last hit, but still, I think that asks the question and answers it. Who wins? Metal Slug vehicles or classic Ravenfield? Well, look at our air superiority and ground superiority. So if you guys do want to see more Ravenfield, we'll pull the trigger on that like button and let me know. And I'll see you in the next one.